Hello guys, welcome back to Chris Poly channel. This video I want to share about global lab update for 11 February 2022 maintenance update. But be notice all content on this global lab video was recorded on global lab server. So this is all content that will update on our live server in future. And mostly all this update will implement on Korea live server for next maintenance update and following outside Korea server if they or be feel this content already ready to release outside Korea server globally. Okay to enjoy Enjoy watch my video, make sure you turn on this video subtitle and also you can use timestamp that I already provide to go to target topic that you want. And if you haven't subscribed yet, don't forget to like, subscribe and turn on bell notification to get any update and guide on Black Desert World. Okay, let's start this video content using any feature that I provide. Okay, this is official website for global lab update at 11 February 2022 maintenance update. First feature update about class balancing, actually on this week global lab update didn't have any class balancing, they just fix some issue for some class. But take notice for Mehwa class, I think Mehwa got nerfed for some skill, but I'm not sure about what skill that she got. And also for her PvP damage reduction rate will increase from this skill from 12% to become 56%. And also for ninja class, they will improve shift Q skill after jumping two times, will activate another skill. And all other class just get some fix from some skill, so I think this is not too a big deal for all. Okay, next about about life skill content, on my last video about Black Desert Weekly News at second week January 2022, we got some info per Abyss will buff life skill content that they will announce it at this February 2022. And on this global lab update, they already mentioned it. First about gathering, in future, they will increase point mastery that you get by leveling your gathering mastery for your character. They will buff mastery point increase for some level grade of your character gathering, especially for the middle of your progression. For your character gathering, they will increase from 5 point to become 10 point. But sadly, starting at artisan 1, this mastery point increase, they will decrease it to become 5 point per level instead 10 point. So by this update for gathering mastery, in future, your new character who just start to do this gathering content will get accumulate mastery point more higher than before. But if your gathering level already reach guru 50, this is will not impact anymore. And also they will increase yield gathering from hog gathering to become 100% increase from any type item that you get and also from chopping tree they will increase capra stone and ancient spirit dust drop rate by 60% compared than before and for fluid collection from tree they will increase capra stone and ancient spirit dust drop rate by 30% than before and also for gathering rock stone meat and blood that you get from gathering they also partially adjust this maximum drop rate but they didn't mention how much this change and because of this adjustment for this gathering drop rate, they will adjust central market price for some crafted item using related item that got impact from this gathering. And then still about life skill content, but right now about hunting using matlock, they just adjust how we use matlock in game. They will change seed control key from using spacebar to become using Q key. And also in future, you can do gathering interaction when your character still seated. And also when your character still seated, you can reload your matlock when moving. And the most important about damage, if your black spirit rates above 100%, your attack damage using matlock will be boosted. And if your hunting level reach guru 1 or higher, and already complete quest for breed of Narxion from suggested tap, your character will automatically have one bullet automatically when reloading on your matlock. And when your character reach guru 1 or higher, maximum ammunition from your matlock will be increased to become for ammunition. And sadly, all these chains I cannot show you on global lab server because this is still not implement on global lab server and also they adjust hunting mastery point cap to obtain rare item gathering to become action on this table so by this update for hunting you can get more rare item from hunting content and also they will increase hunting experience that you gain from killing any hunting monster action on this list you can check on this video description for more detail list for this increase hunting experience as always i already put link for this translated website in this video description you can check it for more detail and also this material that you can get through gathering from this hunting monster will be increased as shown on this list 
And still about hunting, they also add 30 kinds special head ornament for master and guru hunting that's shown on this table. And all this head ornament is decoration item that will give you special buff from 3 until 5 hour duration. Okay, next still about life skill, but related for life skill guild content. First, they will add life mission for guild. And more detail about life skill mission guild that they just add newly, you can check on this video description for more detail list. Because all this item will have specific reward from this mission and you also can get this guild drilling content from this life skill mission and because of this new guild mission they also remove some existing guild mission that's shown on this list in future all this guild mission you cannot get it anymore and also silver reward after you completing guild life mission will be increased as follow on this list For more detail, you can check on this video description. And next, new update about monster. Actually, this is still about hunting content, but special for Mountain of Eternal Winter. They will add new monster, Snow Leopard, that will appeal regularly during night time. And if you hunting this Snow Leopard, you have chance to get this decoration item for your residence. And still about new hunting monster on Mountain of Eternal Winter, they will add Snow Illipika. I don't know, this is just translation from Korean language. This little is hunting monster on some snow field area on mountain of eternal winter and will appear with low probability when you doing hunting monster on mountain of eternal winter area if you already clear all monster around that area and if you success to kill this snow illipika by using matlock you also have chance to get this decoration item for your residence okay next about quest and knowledge in future they will allow to finish weekly quest attraction famalkea twice a week with normal difficulty so you can obtain normal reward from completing this attraction famalkea twice a week and this weekly quest still will reset at thursday midnight time to do this weekly quest twice a week and not only for normal difficulty for elvia difficulty you also can finish this weekly quest twice a week but be noticed cost 10,000 an aggress favor point still will apply when you finishing its weekly quest and this completion for twice weekly quest for attraction falmakea also can be done on seasonal server and if you never finish attraction falmakea i already make special full guide to finish this attraction falmakea you can check this video for more detail how to finish this attraction falmakea with five member party and also another fix and change for user interface system and some another minor change I think all of this not too a big deal for us. Okay, that's all global lab update for 11 February 2022 maintenance update. And special thanks to all my membership for direct support via Patreon, Karya Karsa, and YouTube membership. And also my current member, Zekru, Dubiadut, Jimmy Snack, Doki, Renegades X, Gospel, Homi, Ayrton, Tepan Gaming, Kill Steel, Wemi, Cloudy, Munpai BDO, Jan Andres, Jimon Finding GF, Token R42, Kaimana, Who Mary, Demonite, Cozy, as gold member, and also all my silver and bronze member. Thank you so much for all your direct support. This will make Chris Poly channel running and growing more faster. If you want to support me directly, I will very grateful. And as special thanks, I will put your name on my video. Depend on your support level. And be noticed for some level there are have some limit. So make sure you didn't get run out for this limited space. And I will put your name on every subsequent video that I release for the duration of your support. And if you want to join my membership to support me directly, you can go to any platform for Patreon, Karya Karsa, and YouTube membership. I already put link for this membership on this video description. Or you can check on top right of this video, I already put card for Patreon link. If you like this video, you can like and subscribe to my channel for another guide and update. Thank you for watching. See you next time.